The same thing every hair on the back of his neck stood up when he when they saw that. I had a call from, uh, I got an email first of all from a fella in uh, Washington. This is a new one. So for the people that are really into this, this will be exciting. Um, in fact, if you give me your email after the show, I, I'll email you pictures of the footprints. But uh, it was a, a 21 inch footprint in snow with an eight foot stride. And when you look at the footprints, folks, you know, if you look, if you see somebody's footprints in the snow, there's always like a little drag at the front of the print and after the print. Uh, these are flat stepping, boom, 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 like that. So this fella emails me, he says, gosh, he said, I want to talk to you. He said, but I don't want to be on no monster quest. <laughs> he said, I'll tell you, I'll, I'll send you pictures, and I'll tell you stuff. So he's got this cabin that's five minutes from the Canadian border. And he's got a horse trough outside to feed the horses. He says, if that horse trough runs out of feed, he said, these things will come up and start beating on the side of the house at night and screaming. <laughs> so he says, well, I'm out there pouring the feed in that thing all the time. He said, I'll make sure that sucker's stocked up. <laughs> so he had a buddy staying in this cabin. I'll, I'll look. And his buddy, this is broad daylight, and he's looking out the cabin. He says, man, he says, I saw this thing. It was like standing right behind a tree. It's kind of peeking around at him like this. So his buddy, you know, and he'd have a little dealings with him, so he got him in his sights. He says, I'm just going to shoot that tree and scare the hell out of that whatever that is and have it get out of here. So he aims that rifle. Well, he misses the tree, but about the time he pulls that trigger, this thing looks around that tree, catches it right below the eye, drops like a rock. He said, God, I shot one. He said it wasn't two seconds later, he said there was another one that came out of the woods, threw that thing up over his shoulder, and walked back off the woods with it. He called his friend, he says, Hey, he said, I think I just shot one at your cabin. He said, Oh my God. He said, Don't go anywhere tonight. He said, If uh, you stay right there, you stay, don't leave, because we'll have a big problem. You'll have a big problem. So here's where it got really weird. 